Welcome back, and I may have exaggerated slightly how much I played all this, but it was something like that. Okay, now we're looking for a switch. Hopefully after this video there won't be much left of the cathedral. In fact, I'm really hoping it's just the boss fight. But I really don't know that, so pull that... Pull that switch and go into Spectral Realm, and that stops time, and thus that door will automatically shut. Which will allow us time to come back this way. Hide over here. And before we can go back into Normal Realm, we have to get to that door wherever it is. I'm pretty sure it is down this hallway. In fact, I see, think I see the opening right there. Yeah, there it is. Right by where that bell was. So. We got a puzzle that is optional. I'm going to do it. I'm not so much going to show the solution to it just for video time. There's going to be a lot of fast forwards in this video and whatnot, but. Kill him! Kill him! And as I said, unfortunately, no cutscenes. Kind of unfortunate. Oh, yeah, um, if you pull that switch, that permanently leaves that thing open. So when I, I do come all the way back here, at least. At least I'll be able to go in there now. So, I think I'm gonna have to go. In. I don't remember. I looked at all this stuff as I was editing the video stuff together. But I don't, I already don't remember, so I don't know how I'm gonna get all the way back up there. I guess I'll find out again as I watch this and do commentary. I know I'll come over here, so... Well, not where we're at now. There's some stuff we're gonna wanna jump over. Whee! Yeah, I think I accidentally deleted one of the video files from one of the blocks of the puzzle we're gonna do. My bad on that, but it'll be the only block left, so... I will trust your intelligence to be able to figure that one all out. Given that I'll be eliminating the other ones. Hell, you'll probably see it solved somewhere on the wall as I go to solve the others. I noticed that by, by the time I was done deleting everything, I didn't feel like going back and putting it back in and trying to find it. Like I said, this is optional. Yeah, I got turned around going back in there because I went to the spectral realm and all that. But this is the door we want. And these things just get in the way. Boom! Oh yeah. Sweetness. Okay, so that thing we're looking at right there. This block puzzle is going to open that and it's going to give us another... I don't know what you call them. Those things that when you collect so many of them, they upgrade your health. And I've already seen on a video where two more are. There's one in Melchiah's territory, and I think the other one's in Raziel's area. So, I'm probably actually going to do that before continuing on with this stuff after this video. But, if I were nice, I'd go ahead and do it and tack that on at the end of this video, but I'm not going to. I think it would like kind of confuse things a little bit, so I'm not going to bother. What I'll probably do is finish up the cathedral and then tack it on at the end of that. So, yeah, I guess I showed a little bit of this, but... Yeah, well, that one goes in there. 
And a lot of those blocks that kind of end up making something like that, so a lot of them with similar patterns, you just put them like that and find where they go. This block here is the same way. I still think I cut one of them. Moving that one out of the way because it's about to go right there. Come on, push it! Push it! In fact, I know I cut one of them. I believe that is the third of the four. Oh, God damn it! And there. That's the three of the four. My apologies for cutting the other one. Oh well. I never said this is going to be my finest hour of video making. So... But most of them will be there, so... It's cool. One goes there. That one goes there. And that one there. Should be one more. And there it is. So yeah, my apologies for the one last block, but... Crap, and since it's one of the first ones, it may be tougher to do the process of elimination. Well, shit. Well, you should be able to come over here, see what I did here, and know where these go, and then eliminate where the other one goes, so... It shouldn't be too bad. There's a reason I'm not calling this a walkthrough. Like I guess this is optional. Freaked me the fuck out. I'm guessing y'all didn't hear that, but damn. So yeah, pick that up. Raziel, I said pick it up. Thank you. So, that's upgrade. Well, not upgrading our health yet. We need to collect two. Yeah, in fact, I know I'll collect those before doing the actual fight because. If we're going to be doing a boss fight in here, I should probably have as much health as possible. No, there's some dude outside my apartment coughing. I guess he's going up the stairs near my place. And I wasn't expecting it. It freaked me out. God damn. So yeah, I'm still kind of cutting and boarding some of these fights. Again, let me know how you think I should approach some of these enemy fights. Like, if they don't take long at all for me to deal with, then I'm not going to really worry about it, unless it's during a puzzle. Yeah, I'm forwarding some of this because all we're doing is backtracking here. I still really wish Raziel ran that fast. That would be pretty cool. Oh, now what do we need to do? Kill this douchebag. And it's amazing, I didn't put a chipmunk sound effect in my last video. I did that with a conscious effort. So come down here. Okay, so I guess I just need to make sure I get down here. Okay, that's what I need to do. This is the, that's the part I'm forgetting. And I don't know why I'm running around this room here. I think I was looking to see what was around. I don't know. I'm forwarding part of this because all we're doing is going up this incline. So there's nothing really to important. Just kind of keep going up it and you'll be fine. And that douchebag took my reaver. We're just going to throw him off. I don't know if I accidentally impaled him on something. As long as I threw him off of here, that's all I care about. So. Yeah. Special. Yeah, this is definitely not going to be one of my crowning achievements. Fly! In videos. I, I don't know. I'm just not in that 
jovial mood. I'm not in a bad mood by any means. I'm just not... I didn't really mentally prepare myself for doing commentary today. And I'm kind of in a bit of a rush because I want to finish getting this video put together. So yeah, go to Spectral here because we need to make this stuff all bendy. At this point I was so frustrated, I think I was just looking all this up. Again, I was still trying desperately to get to a save. And the original bit length of all this stuff I put together ended up being over an hour. So I think it ended up being like an hour and 17 minutes. And I chopped it down to like 26, 27 minutes. So that's not bad. Between fast forwarding and cutting. So we come through here. <clears throat> God damn. camera was obscured but yeah apparently I got some drama I gotta deal with with a friend thankfully nothing involving me but that's annoying basically two friends of mine this friend of mine is this girl who is all interested in another friend of ours who is pretty much gay I think he's bi and doesn't want to completely admit to it for whatever reason. I don't know why, but I think he's bi to some extent. I think he's on the gay side of bi more so than anything. And yeah, she's all like into him. And hopefully he won't watch this video because damn, but he probably won't, so I'm not really worried. And if he does, well, hey, what up, man? So, yeah, and they're all coupley, but I've already tried setting her straight, and it's annoying. When somebody's all interested in, or in love or whatever, I don't know if she's in love, but... Whenever somebody's like that, you can't really... Oh, by the way, yeah, those Steam things, yeah, opened up a, another one of those things. Yeah, just open those two up. You have to pick a combination of two of these three. Again, really not that hard. You just have to figure out that it needs to be two out of the three. It's the only thing you need to know. At this point, I was looking it up because, again, I was just tired and I hadn't quite gone into rage mode just yet. I pretty much rage quit at some point on this. But, again, more of the reason I'm doing stuff in, co in post, commentary-wise. And forwarding that just because all it is is backtracking. But, yeah, you can't reason with somebody when they're all gooey over somebody, so I, uh, the only reason I'm going to deal with her for a little bit is because I have something I want to say for comedic value, essentially for comedy for me and another friend who is also not involved in this, so, that is the only reason, so, because if it's not amusing me, I'm not getting involved, I mean, I have the... I have the nice side of me that wants to help my friends out, but if they're not going to listen, they're not going to listen, and there ain't shit you can do to help them. You can only help people who want help. And if they don't want help, there's nothing you can do. It's the same way for addicts and whatnot. Man, this commentary is getting depressing. God damn. Okay, well, I'm sure the next video, if I actually complete the next video for this game, I'm sure I will be so happy that I will make sure it's all jovial and whatnot. Because damn. And I'm not putting sound effects in this video just because I'm lazy. So yeah, we gotta kinda fuck with these. I don't know exactly what you need to do, so I'm just showing all my attempts at messing with them. I think all you do is just press square on them. Actually. But yeah, this is where those lights were that we were seeing in cutscenes whenever we were doing all that stuff. And it's going to open up another air thing. Which will allow us to fly again and allow me to have more frustration because... We gotta land on a pipe and you can overshoot it. Actually, we got two pipes to land on, but I think you can jump from one to the other. Oh god. Whoa. I barely made that. I'm not even going to lie and say that was skill. It was not skill at all. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't know how many times I tried this stuff. And I guess I could afford this, but I'm already doing commentary now, so fuck it. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take part in a friend of mine's misery for my own amusement. Aren't I a nice guy? Glide! Oh god. Land, land, land! Ooh, that was close. I'm guessing if I had overshot. Well, I don't know. Looks like there might be something there. Yeah, we gotta push these things down. I don't know what purpose it is in doing so, but people doing the let's play, the guy doing the let's play that I looked at, did that. So, yeah, now we're back up to the first one again because I fell. Um, we kind of need to get back here anyways because it's easier to get to the next area. And seriously, if I could get my friend that I did Slow River 2 with to come over and just get me back to where I need to be, I so would. Because, damn, I hate redoing stuff. Oh, God. I'm seriously dreading doing all this all over again just to get back to where we left off. I really and truly am. Oh, God. Woe is the life of a Let's Player. Especially a blind Let's Player. Yeah, all this is doing is showing the enemies that are bitches and I guess stuff we have to do. I don't really get what they want here. I just kind of know from again, watching somebody else what to do. So, killing these things, sure, why not? But we got to activate those little switches. You can see one of them. No, actually both of them. One and this will be two. So, but these things respawn, which I find really annoying. I don't know why they had to respawn. Again, kind of the you know you're trying to figure something out here, and they're putting enemies where they really don't need to be. Wow, I barely made that. Damn. And this is what stuck me last time. I could not get... I was only iffy on getting on that first jump. And getting on this pipe, I could not get on it. I mentioned before, there is a thing with three vents. This is it right here. I mentioned this in the previous video. This is where I got. We're about to do some stuff to open up these three vents. And come back here. And that's pretty much as far as I got. Except my recorder stopped working on my way back here. So I won't have the entire backtrack. But I'll have most of it. The important stuff anyways. Come on. There we go. Special. Yeah. My apologies on these videos because these aren't my best work. They're means to an end though because we have to come through here and I've already dedicated enough time over the past few days to this game so... I'm not redoing this. I figure if I'm not bitching about it so much like I was, even in what ended up being the final version of the past video, which is up and you may or may not have seen. Still, okay, remember this area because this is where I got cut off. Uh, we got to come back up right where we're at right now. So find that area. And you're good. Actually, right where we're at now is about where the video cuts off and we're on the back. Yeah, that thing on the left, we gotta climb up there in order to get that. So, take note of that. So, we need to find the... There it is. And some more of those crab spider things are gonna be waiting for us right behind us. Ready to fuck up our world, make our lives miserable. I'm going to ignore them as best I can. So we need to turn that switch, and that activates one of them. Little air vent things. And at this point, I was just like, fuck it. Going to the spectral realm, I don't want to deal with them. Because they're annoying. These things aren't so bad. They're annoying in the repetition of having them show up all the time, but they're not really too annoying, and... Now, at this point, I'm just trying to figure out where to go, and... Oh, I think just on the opposite side of where we need to go to get out of here, actually. I think. Don't quote me on that. Climb, climb, climb. We're looking for a pipe to get up. As opposed to a pipe that we can use for smoking purposes. 
Ooh, I think I see it on the other side. Yeah, I think that is where we... Okay. I think this is where we have to go to backtrack. Pretty sure. But yeah, there's an uh, area over there. Yeah. yeah, there it is. You gotta climb up on that, and I failed. Luckily, I didn't fall the way back down. I'm up. And that actually worked out a little better. So. Now let's go flip the rest of these switches so that we can do whatever's going to happen in the next area, which will probably cause me to rage. I'm almost sure of it. This cathedral... Oh, man. I don't know if you need to ring that bell for anything. I did it. It seems to wake up enemies. The person on the Let's Play I watched was doing it, so fuck it. I figured, well, just in case, like, you need to do it to open something up. I don't think you actually do, because it doesn't actually show anything happen, so... I don't know. It's up to you on that. If you're really worried about it, just save right when you go in there, and... Then, you know... You can try it, whatever happens, happens. And I could have forwarded this and didn't, but oh well. I got the video to manage a boy, so I'm not really all that worried. Okay, so... Yeah, I kind of like that. Just showing like the finishing move on them and cutting out the rest of the battle. Grab this block and... That knocks that down, which we're going to use shortly. And again, as with this area, enemies will show up to mess with us while we're trying to do stuff. Annoying, but what can you do? How the game was designed. I mean, this actually hasn't been the worst gaming experience of my life. Well, I mean, I've actually enjoyed playing this game, except for the cathedral. I can't really bitch too much, because I don't think I will, I mean, I'm glad I did Soul Reaver 2, and, um, but I don't know if I'll ever play, I, in fact, I won't ever play that game again, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, flip that switch, and that will do that. But I'll also have the videos of me doing it, so I can watch them for my own amusement whenever I wish. And since... It's more good to watch these just for the cutscenes. Not that big of a deal. Alright, kind of look around and find this and then jump up on the tent. And kind of run and run and run. Fuck. Definitely run now because now we don't have a weapon. There was one actually over there, but I'm glad I left it where it is because I'm going to need it later. I really don't like those things. Oh, and the way out of this area we're in now is just where we are. Well, that area where we just came through, which is where we're going to have to go through to backtrack, if you spectral realm, the portal will be right there. I wander up forever lost trying to find that area. But yeah, the portal thing will be right there. So Come up here. This is going to be a bit jumbled because I went up here once, fell off, and didn't really know the area well enough to edit this properly, so... I think this is where we need to go to the right. Yeah, that looks like the same area. Okay, yeah, so come over here. And I believe I forward some of this. Yeah. Let's start looking around. I'm trying to make sure I don't fall off, because there are enemies down there that I did not deal with. So... Kind of make your way. I mean, this isn't ultra complicated or anything. That beam thing right there, we gotta push that. So right now, I was just trying to find a good place to kind of come down on. But yeah, Soul River 2, I just... There's enough annoying parts on that game. I don't think I'll ever play that game again, unless I suddenly get good at doing the air reaver thing and swimming and this and that walking through dark areas so now we want to go up in this area but it's cool you know I made it through hopefully I'll make it through this one I hope since I've already been uploading videos of it 
I may, I'm mainly uploading these for that friend of mine I did sell Reaver 2 with. And now one new subscriber I got who is apparently a fan of these. And I believe, yeah, that's all three of them. So. My, yeah, so right here is where we would have, oh, and damn, I didn't point that out. Uh, the same thing that happened before, uh, you could have seen it briefly, those crab things were like all stuck on, um, uh, no, spiders, whatever, um, uh, on one of those things over there. It's pretty funny. I showed it off in the last video, them getting stuck on there. A lot better than dealing with things chasing me. Uh, we got that. We gotta move that block again. That weapon is if you climb up above where we were pull that switch in this area. That's where you get that. But I call it, cut all that in the interest of time. Now we need to move this block so we can get out. And we are about to where my video recording program cut off. Uh, we'll get back into that room I said, so uh, just try to remember where that was you came in when you get here because you gotta backtrack to get out, so yeah. My apologies if this cathedral stuff just has not been the most pleasant. It wasn't really all that... It was pretty awful for me recording it and like I said, this video I just wasn't really in a commentary mood, so my apologies. I hope you enjoyed it anyways. Thank you very much for watching, and I guess I'll just let the video play itself out, um, and I will see y'all next video. I'm gonna go fuck with my friends. Actually, yeah, we jump down here first, and then, alright, fine. Now, I will see y'all next time.